Welcome back to the Oasis on the new Classical FM. I'm Kathleen Kajioka. We have moved over to Zoomer Hall to meet a young pianist. Ryan Wang is a 10-year-old prodigy from Vancouver, and his mom says that he sang before he talked, and she enrolled him in music classes for toddlers. He started playing piano when he was four, and by the time he was five, he was making his Carnegie Hall debut. He's making his Toronto debut tomorrow in a recital presented by the Lee Dillon Music Foundation at the Fairview Library. Theater, and on Saturday he'll be soloist in Beethoven's Piano Concerto Number no. Two with the Toronto Festival Orchestra. Right now we're going to hear him play some Debussy. Here's Ryan Wang with the Arabesque Number no. One.
That was the music of Claude Debussy on the new Classical FM, the arabesque number one played by young pianist Ryan Wang. That was incredible. You've, you're 10 years old, uh, but you sound like you've been playing for twice your lifetime. Uh, how did you get interested in playing, in piano, playing piano in the first place? Uh, so basically, when I was really young, uh, I used to go to my neighbor's house all the time to play their piano, and um, I loved it. So then I begged my parents to buy a piano, and finally they um, gave me music lessons. They found a teacher that gave me music lessons, and I started playing the piano, and I loved it. And do you still love it just as much as back then when you were three, four years old? Yes. Yeah. For performing for you, do you get nervous before, or is it just fun for you? Uh, I think it's, like, fun because it's a hobby, and I love it, so I think it's just really fun, and uh, I appreciate how I get to perform in so many places around the world. Yeah, well, tell me about some of the places uh, that you have performed already. Uh, I've performed in the in Casa Maggiore in Italy, their international music festival. I performed in many places in China. I performed in uh, Vancouver, my hometown. And um, I've performed in Singapore. And uh, That's a lot of yeah, places. And I, and I performed in Toronto before, and I'm very glad to come back. OK, so uh, and what's your, what was your favorite place so far to perform? Um, I think my favorite place were the Niagara Falls and the CN Tower. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. Now, you must spend a lot of time practicing. How many hours a day do you spend? Uh, I spend piano? one and a half hours to two hours practicing the piano. But if I have more schoolwork, then I might practice like one and a half hour to one hour, 45 minutes. But if um, I'm near to a concert, then I might practice two hours to two and a half hours. Wow, incredible. You get a lot done in a very short amount of time by Thanks. my estimation. Uh, we're going to hear more music from you now. Uh, some Mendelssohn. Yes. We are going to hear the Spinner song. Is this, is this a favorite of yours? Uh, yes, uh, it actually is. I think it's very fun to play because um, it's like a spinning, you know, dancing around. Okay. Spinning. Here once so. again is Ryan Wang to play Mendelssohn's Spinner's Song on the new Classical FM. Uh, Felix Mendelssohn, that was his delightful spinning song played by 10-year-old piano prodigy Ryan Wang, who is here from Vancouver to perform a couple of concerts in Toronto, and I'll tell you about those in a few minutes. But first, you made your Carnegie Hall debut after winning a competition, right, when you were five years old. 
Is that right? Yeah. Yes. And how was that for you playing in that historic hall? Um, that was a great experience. And then after that, you got a lot of attention. You were on 60 Minutes and on the Ellen Show and did yes. a lot of TV interviews. Are you as comfortable in front of the camera as you are in front of the uh, keyboard? Yes, um, <laughs> I love being on the camera. Yeah, how was it being on Ellen's show? It looked like a lot of fun. Uh, yeah, it was a lot of fun. It was basically just like talking to a friend almost. Yeah, yeah. She's, she's very warm. Yes. And did you ever get a chance to perform in that blue tux she gave you? Oh, yes. Uh, I performed in many performances in that blue tux she gave yeah, me. It was, it was very nice. Very yeah. suave. Very, very nice. Now, surely you have other interests as well, other than piano. Uh, what yes. else occupies your time? What else do you like to do? Uh, I like to snowboard. I like to ski. Um, I love to eat and read. Um, I love doing sports. And um, I actually love school. Yeah? Uh, yeah, that's... Um, that's it's very interesting school any particular um, subjects that grab you uh yes um i like pe science and music uh-huh. those mm-hmm. actually all relate in a way i think the physical aspect of playing music and there's a lot of math involved in the science and everything mm-hmm. um so tomorrow you are going to be performing at uh, the Fairview Library Theatre. Uh, can you tell us a little bit about the program that you're going to be playing? Uh, yes, um, I'm going to be playing uh, the French Suite Number no. 6 in E Major so Bach. by Bach. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm going to be playing the uh, Sonata in C Major by Joseph Haydn. Uh, then I'm going to be playing the Poulenc um, Vals. Yeah, uh, it's the a suite for the enfant, you know. Mm-hmm. And then uh, and after that, I'm going to be playing the Debussy arabesque. Um, after that, I'm going to be playing the Bartok, uh, Romanian folk dances. That's a great piece, And then I'm yeah. going to be playing three Chopin pieces, uh, the Polonaise, um, and I'm going to be playing an etude, and I'm also going to be playing the... Um, fantasy impromptu, which I'm going to be playing next. Right, yes. Okay, so tickets, by the way, if you want to head to that concert, can be bought at canadaticketbox.com, and it's presented by the Lee Dillon Musical Foundation. We are going to hear one last piece from you now, as you mentioned, the fantasy impromptu by Chopin. Thank you so much for coming to play for us, and I look forward to Um, this piece. Thank you for inviting me. Ryan Wang with some Chopin on the new Classical FM.
Beautiful playing by 10-year-old piano prodigy Ryan Wang of Vancouver uh, right here at Zoomer Hall. Uh, That was the Fantasy Impromptu Opus 66 by Frédéric Chopin. You can catch Ryan's solo recital tomorrow at the Fairview Library Theatre and he'll be performing Beethoven's Second Concerto at the George Weston Recital Hall on Saturday. Tickets are available at canadaticketbox.com. Many thanks to Ryan for stopping by to play for us. You are listening to The Oasis. I'm Kathleen Kajioka in for Carrie Stratton. Back to business now. Here's traffic.